you're having a kick in the in the VFL, is that what it's called? Yeah, in the VFL now. Yeah, so in the men's VFL or the, the women's? In the women's one. In the women's? We don't quite want to play with the uh Why the not? Men. You don't want to show us up? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> who, do you, who do you play for? Uh, with Melbourne Uni and that. Okay, he's, um, it's, it's the game of the year started, yeah? Yeah, we've played our second game um, for the year. So we played the reigning premiers in Darabin round one and we knocked them off. That's good stuff. About 30 odd points. Yeah. And then we, we had our round two last weekend against St Kilda and we almost lost it in the uh, last quarter. We were up by a little bit and then they came back within five points. One of our girls in our team took, you know, the Leo Barry style no. mark late in the last yeah. quarter, so which saved us a fair bit. Good. Oh. Did you mean that? <laughs> yeah, did yeah. that on purpose. Because you're a marquee player at the Bulldogs, do they have any concerns about you playing VFL footy where you might get hurt and fuck your season up for the Bulldogs? Um, oh, I'd set that up for you then. You got, you got one more. Oh, lucky you know the rules of footy. Yeah. Um, um, they've kind of given us a guideline not to overdo it too much and to... Don't, don't stick your head over the footy, just run around <laughs> like a boundary umpire. Still play footy, but you know, don't um, play if you're too sore or, you know, those basic kind of rules. Yeah. Our season was only seven weeks for the AFLW and only 14 for the VFL, so, which kind of helps that. So ideally, so does that mean you have a pre, so you, do you do two pre-seasons or just you go, do you go straight from AFL women straight into? Pretty much, we had about a month off and then we jumped straight into it again, so, which was lovely. How was your, um, how was your Mad Monday? Yeah, it was good, really good. We, yeah. um, everybody loves a, a mad Monday, I'm sure. Well, you're not wrong. That's, um, why, that's why I played AFL <laughs> and for footy trips. <laughs> yeah, footy trips and mad Monday. Did you just have one? Yeah, we had both. Yeah. I'll, so, which was a grouse. I don't think, I don't, I don't know if the Collingwood one had any. I need to, it's, no, wonder, no, no wonder they can't win a game, the <laughs> men and the women. They need to start going on footy trips and start having a beer. The women won more than us. Where did you go on a footy trip? We went down to Sorrento. Yeah, how was that? Yeah, it was Hectic. really good. We, um, yeah, had a really good weekend. No doubt. Yeah. So, which I was think. ideal. Um, you know, didn't get into any mischief or yeah, well bullshit. behaved. And That's <laughs> another lie, just like you don't have many Twitter followers you got. <laughs> have you had a, a favourite trip away? Footy trip or? Yeah, my favourite footy trip. Um, my last one actually was just the Bali, and that was with like probably seven or eight of the Collingwood boys who I don't usually go away with any of you. Know, I had an unbelievable time there, but um, that was my goodbye one. But <laughs> Stockstead one was probably, uh, well, last year's one was last year's one was fun. We went, me, Dusty, another car old mates did Amsterdam, Prague, London, New York, Brazil, Argentina. Dubai, so that, that was that was good fun. Which one was your, where was your favourite place um, in that trip? I, I like Argentina, Buenos Aires was awesome. Um, that was great, but if I, thank you. But uh, <laughs> New York's probably the, I love New York. That's probably my favourite city in the world. So that, we had Halloween there. That was awesome. Nice. Um, and the good thing about the States in Halloween, everyone actually dresses up like me and does were, went to San Diego for Halloween a couple of years ago and the whole week people dressed up. So we went to a bar and like, Halloween fell on the Saturday night. We went out on the Wednesday night just for a look and a few beers and everyone was dressed up. We went home because we felt embarrassed we weren't dressed up. <laughs> so they, like, they make you dress up and they make you look like an idiot for a night. So um, <laughs> I get into it. Halloween over there is great. So I'm, I'll definitely do that this year. The weird thing is that I'm going on a footy trip this year. I haven't played a game of footy. So <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to get that one past me. Missus. She doesn't know yet, so I'm going to have to run home tonight and tell her. But um, my couple of my mates need a chaperone, I think. I think I'm the um, designated driver overseas. Oh well. You won. Well, there you go. I was so, giving you a good head start. Yeah. Well, you got closer than you got closer than anyone of the males that I've played against. So, thanks for joining us. Not a um, Thank you. And good luck in your VFL season. Then I wish you good luck against the Bulldogs. But I, you know, obviously vote for the Pies. So, um, I right. hope we kick your ass. But I hope you play well <laughs> individually, and um, you know, you make pitch and pick us some money. Yeah. Thank you.